What's up, beaches? Arthur here. Now, this video is really just for people born before. <clears throat> What's up, beaches? Arthur here. Now, this video is just for my people born for before. Ooh, one more time with words. <laughs> What's up, beaches? Arthur here. Now, this video is just for my people born before 1965 because we are talking about some real hardcover books here. I've got Oliver Sacks Gratitude. And this is really me on my mission to go out and to seek wisdom from people that have lived great, exciting, long, prosperous, engaged lives. Because um, here at my my youthful young age, just turned 31 this year, I'm looking forward to a long life ahead of me, but I know I'm going to need the, the wisdom of, of others to get there. And so that's why I've been using books like Oliver Sacks Gratitude to get a little bit more perspective here. And so there's a quote that I want to share here, very specifically on perspective. <clears throat> My father, who lived to 94, often said that the 80s had been one of the most enjoyable decades of his life. He felt, as I begin to feel, not a shrinking, but an enlargement of mental life and perspective. One has had long experience of life, not only one's own life, but others too. One has seen triumphs, tragedies, booms and busts, revolutions, wars, great achievements, and deep ambiguities. One has seen grand theories rise only to be toppled by stubborn facts. One is more conscious of transience and perhaps of beauty. At 80, one can take a long view and have a vivid, lived sense of history not possible at an earlier age. I can imagine and feel in my bones what a century is like. I'm just going to take a moment and let that sink in for a second. The the big thing for me is I I feel that people have this people have this very negative sense or this very negative view of aging that suddenly you turn suddenly you turn 30 or you turn 40 or you turn 50 or god forbid you turn 80 and suddenly life is is over that you're you know you're boring or that you're not useful anymore or that nobody wants you around anymore or whatever whatever that negative thought might be and reading this quote really helped to kind of put into my head the idea that no actually aging and maturing and gaining wisdom is actually a really positive thing because you get you have so much more perspective on life and the world and so this quote the reason i'm sharing it is really just a shout out to everybody out there who who feels like they've lived great lives and to to feel that you know to be 80 is not a negative thing but it's actually a positive thing um and it's something and this feels kind of weird to say but something that i'm actually looking forward to being at that stage in my life when i have that when i have that wisdom and that have that perspective and being able to look back on life and all that young kids these days and and all of that and so i'm putting this video out there as as an appreciation to everybody who has lived great and amazing lives um, and to say thank you for all that you've done and for being around and just for continuing um all that you all that you contribute and whether that's you know whether that's sharing whether that's sharing a thought whether it's sharing a joke whether it's sharing a story of you know how life used to be back in the day that that wisdom that you have that you continue to share i just want to say thank you for all that you're doing and so from me to you to my beaches community this is arthur saying thank you and i look forward to speaking with you soon